Aww. What the hell's that thing? One Jabug, two Jabug, three Jabug are all on board the roller. Yes, we should be ready for them to lend us electricity, eh, Sophie? Thank you. Togdemaru and Chargerbug get along very well. We use Togdemaru's ability, Lightning Rod, to absorb any sudden surges from Chargerbug so we don't get zapped. Oh, and by the way, we gave Togdemaru a nickname, Togamaru. So what do you, do you want to begin my trial? I've been waiting for it. Wow, you're really into this. Okay, let me explain how it works. Oh, it's like a puzzle. You need to connect the charger bug that are on the roller. We use electricity from the charger bug to power the machine. That should let us call the totem Pokemon. Use the four buttons on the edges of the roller to rotate the panels and connect the charger bug in a line. So this is just an example of what happens. Ah, okay, so it's a puzzle. You don't need to worry about which way they're facing, just as long as they're connected in a line. Let me summarize. We connect them to summon the totem, which you will hopefully defeat. As a side note, this is the first time we're using the two machines, the roller and the pinger. So let's get this trial going, okay? My trial is about to begin. Okay. So if I press... This one... And then this one. That's it. <laughs> now we're ready to power up the pinger. Yes, it works. It's moving along the cable. Oh, it's a vault. It's a Vika vault. From the back, it looks like a like that butthole looks like a nose. It's like it looks some sort of weird like uh, bunny Pokemon. It's actually working. The Pinger is getting a good dose of power. Now the totem should appear any minute. Zap. I know an Elekid. Oh no, the other kid fainted. <laughs> the other kid was pure electric, uh, by the way. Ah, of course, the other kid love electricity too. It must have been tempted by the pinger. We didn't call the Pokemon we wanted, but it seems like the pinger works just fine. So what now, Sophie? I think one row isn't giving it enough electricity. In that case, we need to add another circuit. If my theory is correct, it should let us pump more power into the Pinga. So my trial will continue, Hippocrisis. Okay, so if I do this one, and then that one again, that gets me back to where I started. So it's that one, then this one, and then this one again. There we are. Now we're ready to power up the Pinga. Come on, come on, come on. Well, there's nine of them, so I don't know if we'll have to do another little battle and then get a third line in our line, but there's only two outputs, so... Oh, now it's an Electabuzz. Actually, I seem to remember there being fights as part of the quiz, but maybe it was when you got the question wrong, something fought you. Uh, let's try a thrash this time. And we've got level and more, well, nice. Hmm, Electivores. Seems the more power we pump in, the bigger Pokemon it attracts. This is amazing, Sophie. If that's the case, I'll give it some more power. That'll definitely summon the totem. Is it going to summon a Totem Electivire? Because that would be amazing. It's probably going to be V-Cobalt. Um, 
The great line, the great, because I noticed that, like, Mallow's trial, the trial changed. And this one, the trial changed. And Mallow's trial, the totem didn't change. But on the ones where the trial was the same, the totem changed. Does that make sense? Uh, the greater the electrical current that is generated, the longer it flows. So that means... I've got it. Actually, I think he's already got it too. My trial will continue. Okay, so this one... Oh, I've got to join them up. I see. There we go. That's it, right? No? Um, oh, wait. One going diagonally in each way like a Z. No? <laughs> oh, wait. That's an S. It needs a Z's the other way around. Okay, the charger bug are all connected. Everything should be good to go now. We're ready to connect the roller with the pinger. Oh, the cable's looking a bit unstable. Sure hope it doesn't cause a problem. Wait, is the Pokemon inside? Oh no, the charger bug will get blasted with electricity if we don't do something. Isn't that what Togedemaru's for? Is he the totem? Is he going to get blasted and supercharged? Togedemaru, what are you doing? Are you trying to save everyone? I like how I've had about nine theories. The current is too strong. There's no way Togedemaru's electric sacks can handle all of that. Togedemaru, hang in there. Ah, I gotta do something! <laughs> so, it was a Togedemaru after all, except for it wasn't what I thought. Zzzzap! You were challenged by the Togan to Totem Togadamaru. Okay, so he is steel. Do I still have Inferno Overdrive? I do. I'm going to give it a go. Oh no! Damn it! I think that's like protect, so it's not gonna do. It's not gonna have the full effect. Look at all that it did! Damn it! Oh, and now Skarmory's here as well. Is this a Steel-type trial? Oh my god, okay. Um. Now if that, if it does all that damage from um, from Firefang, imagine what it would have done had it not protected itself. Oh man, that's such a bummer. Oh, the Tailwind makes them faster. I guess that makes sense. Okay, we're going to use Ampharos. Because he's weak to Electric and he's weak to Bulldoze. We're going to start with a Electro Ball on Skarmory. Try and get rid of him. Okay, he's scattering rocks, so when we throw someone out... Oh, he's got Lightning Rod, of course he has! And that heals him, doesn't it? Or speeds him up or something. Okay. Oh, that was an idiot move of mine, I should just use... Uh, Bulldoze. Ooh. The surprise steel-type... Um, 
friend has completely thrown me off. Okay. Oh, it barely even hit him. Can't believe I wasted that Z move, that's so annoying. Oh, he's torn to me? Okay. Um, is he weak to... Fighting? Yes. Oh yeah, I'm gonna use bulldoze. I'm getting it. Yes. Oh no. Um, is it worth healing Amphros? Maybe. I think it is. Yes. Um, needs like a hundred, so that's a high potion. Might be worth doing a max restore actually instead, but let's let's heal Amphros first because we can always. Okay, the Tailwind's ended. If he's up there, does the Vault Absorb work? I may as well try it, just in case I'm uh, faster again. Oh, it still works. That's annoying. At least his attack missed. Um, okay, so let's Bulldoze again. Oh, we've got Paralysis on Skarmory, which is good. Oh, but I keep flinching. I don't like it when it takes this long, when because it, it's it's the computer guess like judging what I'm doing. So, Ugh. these guys are really trying my patience. Flinched again. I thought the Tailwind already petered out. Okay, let's um, use this turn to get a Max Revive on... Lycanroc. No jokes on you, because I didn't attack. Good, well that was a free round, so let's try a Bulldoze this time. But I didn't use. The, oh. I thought I tried. I thought I tried to brick break last time. But anyway. Right. So now I'm going to be slower. So now he might kill me. But I'll, I'll just let him. So let's do a bulldoze. Okay, let's use Firefang on Togdemaru. Burn? Damn it. I needed the burn. That was the only point of re reinstating him. Anyway, okay, so who should we use next? Mowile, because Mowile's got that fighting move. 
as well as being Steel himself, herself, and that reduces their attack as well, which would have been good to have done before. Anyway, it's fine. I just want a totem out of the way. I don't care about Skarmory. Hopefully this just kills Togemaru. Yep. Yeah. I think I should have turned to Skarmory, uh, to Moal before, because I think it's a physical attacker. Okay, now let's just do whatever we can. That's not very effective because it's steel. Um, but Crunch should hit Skarmory fine. Just a case of, like, attacking and just using all my other Pokemon to attack until he's dead. Or maybe re reviving Ampharos, actually. And just using an electric attack. I think that'll be a lot quicker. Uh, so let's go with where's revives are at the top of this pocket on there we are. I think there's no point dragging it out even further. Mowile survives this. Didn't I say I'll, if Mowile survived that I was gonna use um like heal on frost even more. But is a is a tailwind gone now? Choose Electro Ball. There we go. Whew. That was a trial, but for all the wrong reasons. Thanks, Hippo Crisis. Togemaru and company. They were saved by the totem. The totem is really something else, and that means you're one heck of a trainer having to beat him, Hero Crisis. I'm curious though, what's that aura that totem Pokemon surround themselves with? I really need to work on totem calling machines though. Togdemoru and Wanjibug and company, they're my precious friends. You've got it right, Sophie. Finding things that you notice, even little things, and improving on them, that's how science works. Come to think of it, that's how Pokemon battles work too. Here, Hippo Crisis, I'll give you this Electrium Z to reward you for beating the totem. Yes! Come on, Sophie. You still need to show him the proper Z-pose to use it. Watch. Congratulations on clearing your trial. And Sophocles did well as captain too. I was really nervous. Don't you worry, I'm sure I made the right choice in naming you captain, even if you are my cousin. Usually it's the island Kahuna who appoints the captains, but there are unusual circumstances here on Ola Ola. Sometimes, I en somehow I end up captain. But you're a really great hippo crisis. Maybe you should invite him to check out your battle agency in that case. Big Mo, you're a genius, that's a marvellous idea. Hippo crisis, come with me to one of the Festival Plaza's most unique facilities, the battle agency. You kids have a good time! Welcome to the reception desk. Not to brag, but this facility is pretty sweet. First, go ahead and borrow a Pokemon at reception desk. You can choose one of three. Once you've borrowed a Pokemon, next is asking trainers to join your team. Look for trainers who have strong Pokemon, battle alongside your teammates and get rewards. If you keep winning, your grade will go up. If your grade goes up, you can battle with stronger Pokemon. Battle a lot and raise your grade. That's how it works. Go ahead and give it a try. How was that? Pretty cool, right? Well, if you're done here, I can ask you a favour. My pal Kukui seems to have forgotten this. You you obtained the Professor's Mask. He said he'd be going back to Melee Garden. Sorry to ask, but would you take it to him? Next time, we can battle too. 
Thank you for watching, liking, and subscribing. I have been Dan, you have been awesome, and don't forget to check out more of my content on the screen right now. If you want to watch more of my videos, there's also more playlists in the description, and the full playlist for Pokemon Ultra Sun is in the top right corner on the eye. Bye guys!